Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Siobhan. If you're new here, welcome. So I'm sharing a weekend shop and trip haul. I went to quite a few stores from Saturday to Sunday and Monday. So here we go. So the first up is Michael's and I got some stuff to decorate my office for Valentine's Day. I have this little garland. It was really cute. The Valentine's Day items are 40% off and this was 15 bucks. So we didn't, we got quite a few items. My daughter also got some stuff too for her room. I got this Be Mine sticker book so I can decorate my February setup. That's probably what I end up decorating once my planner setup is ready. And I got these little foam stickers. I was going to put them around my desk, but I'm not sure yet. I'm going to use this to make like um, a bookmark for the month of February. Uh, I don't know if I said it says Happy Valentine's Day. And this was probably, it was $3.99 with 40% off. Then I got this pink and white doily. It's not to use just for this month. I'm going to use it for when I'm decorating my planner spreads, like my journaling spreads and stuff like that. And then this is a part of their, I don't know the name of the collection, but it's sort of like shabby chic, um, high tea and stuff like that. So I've been wanting a few more items and I'm going to get, and I got this. This was $24.99. They're finally 40% off. And then I got these two storage books. So inside is a pink polka dot, which is super cute. I got two of these. These were 15 bucks each and then the 40% off. And I got some flowers because I'm trying to change the one on my desk. I got this flower and this one. So that's my Michael's haul. And then I'm going to move on. Well, I'm going to show you where I'm going to replace the flowers. So right now I have this little vase from the same collection. And those were just some old flowers that I had on my Christmas tree. So I'm going to remove those and make a little bouquet for right here. And I also got this little um, wall cabinet. What would you? A shelf this little shelf thing it's a part of the same collection i bought it the day before and my husband mounted it for me right here so i can store other items above my desk and i ran my uh, my plants up i wanted to kind of vine a little bit more and then i put the other plant up on that side so that's where i'm going to put those flowers up top and then the picture with the teacups I don't know where I'm going to put them yet. I'm probably going to put them somewhere over here. I'm not really finished working on this side of the room. So where that gold frame is up top, I've been dying to kind of revamp that and take down the gold picture frames. So I may put it over there. And I have some decorative teacups and little plates that I can also put up there and then I have to work on the top so the garland I think I'm gonna just hang it across the my little thing right here and not sure yet but I'm just kind of trying to envision how I'm decorating everything so Target had a lot of cute things in their dollar section so this one says Cupid's bed and breakfast and then this one says special delivery fresh cut roses chocolate wine so these were both five bucks each and the red one is for my daughter she didn't want a pink one so i took the pink of course and what i'm gonna do with those i'm gonna use it like a movie night tray i'm gonna clean it out the best i can without getting it like super soap because it's i don't know what type of material it is i may line it somehow and once I line it, I'm going to use it for when we're doing movie night. We can do like um, popcorn, popcorn, some candy, maybe some cookies, maybe like a cup of fruits or something like that. But like a serving tray. That's what I want to use it for. But I'm going to try to line it. So because I know these things are coated with lots of chemicals and stuff. So 
I don't know the best way to clean it without damaging it too much, but I will give it a shot. They had a lot of stuff for um, Valentine's Day. This I got. I love having this in my office. And then my daughter got this in case she wanted to do like a charcuterie tray. So this is for um, February. So in the section where they had a lot of the decor items, we picked out two of these cars and mine broke. So I'm just going to use my hot glue gun and glue it. I don't feel like returning it to the store. I don't know when it broke, but when we came home, it was broken in the bag. That was not in the dollar section, but it was five bucks. And then this item is, it's like a popcorn maker and it's glass. The lid does come off. So for this, I'm going to use it to eat my popcorn out of, or if I have like gourmet popcorn that is not, that comes in a bag, I can store it in it. I can't open the top, but it was really easy to open up and what i'm going to also do i'm going to paint the outside i'm going to make it really pretty and paint the wheels and everything so it could look more like a popcorn cart since my husband didn't even know what it was and the last two items was this valentine's cookie house i love that they're having a house to decorate for like all the holidays i I'm going to work on this with Lonnie. We like, we like doing it together, so we just bought one. You can get the one house or you can get the mini houses. And then we got these two cookies. These are hard cookies and it's a decorating kit. Comes with your frosting and the sprinkles. It's a really big cookie. It's one in each um, package. And I don't remember the cost. It was probably three or four bucks. So we bought two of those. So everything here is all from... Yosika stationery. I don't know if it's Yosika or, or Yoseka. This is some frame stickers. These are 40 pieces each. And I'm going to use this for when I'm journaling. These are super cute. I got the last two that was there. This can last me for the whole year. And in stickers, I got this pack of stickers. And you can see the design on the back so these are the new stickers that i like these are the the rub on ones so you basically let me show you how it works these are sealed in so it's, it's like um when you do the cricket designs and then you do like the, with the transfer tape it's the same thing it comes on these clear paper and it does have like a sheet underneath it so this, I will just put it down on whatever surface I want it on and then just rub it. So they're like rub-on stickers. And I bought some the other day after seeing someone with it on Instagram and I'm in love and I keep buying more and more. So I got this one, this, this, and this. I did order quite a few more on their website because the in-store inventory is not that big of a selection like they have online. And then I got these airmail envelopes. These reminds me of when I used to live in Jamaica. This is how we used to get letters from my mom when she was in America. But I want to use this when I'm traveling. It's just the nostalgia about it. I just had to pick it up. Then I got these little weekly post-it. So they're seven days a week. And I don't know what I'm going to use it for, but I liked it. This is a scissors. It's like a portable scissors. It's going to be perfect for when I'm packing my travel bag to journal and memory plan on the go. And I didn't realize that I picked up both of these, but I really just wanted one. I don't like silver hardware and anything. But this is a pen hook. You can hook it on your planner or your notebook and you just put your pen through it. And then these are some markers that I got. Um, this one, is, it's glittery. I don't know if I have anything to try it on. But I didn't really want to open them yet. This is why I don't like doing hauls. Because someone's going to be like, how does it write? And stuff like that. But I don't have a flat surface because this is the blanket. But it has like a shimmer glitter. glitter. And this brand is Kira Rich. K-I-R-A-R-I-C-H. And it's from Zebra. This one was a little bit unique to me.
because it had two tips. It had a light pink and a dark pink. So this is like multitasking. You can just have one and carry this and you have like a light highlighter and a darker shade of pink. This is my, I think I found my pink in my in the Mars liner that is for me. It's like the perfect pink. You can't really tell on camera, but it's a really beautiful pink. And I don't know if these, if this represents the number, then this is 100. In case anyone is interested, it says 100 in a box. I can never tell what the numbers are. This I'm not going to open because it's sealed until I'm ready to use it. But it's just these, these color dot markers. I can use these for making lists. And this was a paint pen, basically. It's called Pentel Milky Brush. And it's just a paint marker. That's all this is. So that's the, the stationery store haul. And then I went to another stationery store. It was stationery slash crafts, candles. It was just a little cute store. I don't, I don't even know the name of some, what something like that would be considered. But anyway, I got this decal sticker. It says Brooklyn. And I got this pack of gum. They taste like chiclets. It says, yeah, you can read. And then this rule notebook. I wanted a thin notebook to tuck in my planner. And then this, the first store we went to was a craft store called Brooklyn Craft Company. This is the address. It's 165 Greenpoint Avenue. And if you go to brooklyncraftcompany.com, you can find classes. I definitely want to take the watercolor class because I have all my watercolor supplies that I haven't been using. And they sell a lot of sewing things. There's also sewing workshops and different things. So check them out. And I got this to put in my current setup that I'm working on. And my planner is in reach, so I'm going to just grab it really quickly. So in the planner that I'm setting up, see, I did a lot. I'm almost done. I have this section where I can jot down places that I want to visit. And I'm going to put that in that section. Because I'm, I basically just started. I didn't really know where it was. So this is a section in my planner that says places to visit. So it says places to visit and I made this ticket on Canva and on the back, these are just some stickers that I already had. So I want to keep this in this section. I don't know how I'm going to fit it in, but I'm going to just cut the front off and use it somewhere here. When I'm making a tab for the section, this is going to be the tab. It says adult ticket. Or if I can get like a sticker that says admit, but that's what this is for. I'm going to take that back out so the next store i went to these were all in brooklyn these three stores the stationery store the craft store yoseka is in brooklyn and then we went into the city okay i also got this from the the, the craft store brooklyn craft company so when we went into the city we went to the west village and my stony clover pouch that I had with my custom initials on it I screwed it up when I ordered so I dropped it off and then I picked up this little charm for my bag this was on sale and I already I have the bag with the same print and I got this little words project bracelet that says love so I've been I had bracelets from little words project for years a couple years and I didn't know they had a store and everything but my daughter loves their bracelets I love their bracelets we went to little words and I got this these two bracelets one says hope and one says faith I love how this has the it's like a flower bracelet they are stretchy I'm gonna show you they are a bit stretchy um, I don't know if they come in different sizes, but my wrist is pretty small. They fit my daughter perfectly. Maybe if you have like, um, if your wrists are a little bit bigger than mine, you probably get a larger size, but I, I'm not sure. In addition to the bracelets I got, I love vinyl stickers. 
and these are going to go in my self-care section of my planner it says you're doing great sweetie and then you're a badass and then i have this taxi sticker and this one that says keep going so these are in the village and then we went to the lily sadugi store next which was in the same area and i got these two headbands these were on my list and these are absolutely beautiful i love this one especially it's it's so extra but the the way how it's just flat it's gorgeous i love her headbands and i got this one. Oh, you can't see it i'm sorry let me put up the camera i got this one so i got these two headbands and these were on my headband accessory tray i'm gonna show you where i keep them so this is where i keep all of my headbands and i'm just gonna put those over there so that is my headband collection so that's pretty much it um, i'm gonna go work on my planner and do a little bit of tidying up if you want to see the mess this is the mess this is where i was filming and i'm gonna go finish clean up and do some planner setup and then eat dinner so thanks so much for watching this video and i'll see you next time